Marine litter poses one of the greatest threats to the health of the oceans of the world. The Sustainable Development Department in St. Lucia is receiving assistance from UNEP to create a marine litter management action plan. Stakeholders and the department met this week to gather feedback in formulating this strategy. Sustainable Development Minister Sean Edward says this is timely as the country looks to explore alternatives to employment in the marine sector. We are looking to transition from our traditional economic pillars and, and, and make use of the marine environment as a form of, of as an economic niche, so to speak, and that is why we have been giving expression to the whole notion of the blue economy. Um, and basically, we're just looking to maximize the economic potential, as I said, that can be derived from the, the marine, marine ecosystem. Marine litter can cause serious economic damage, which may result in losses for coastal communities, tourism and fishing sectors. The Marine Action Plan will also look at the issue of coherence. There are many organizations that are involved in the management of waste in one way or the other. So it's not simply uh, one organization, um, but it's the private sector, the public sector, it's civil society, it's stakeholders, it's everyone really that has a role to play. The recyclers, the supermarkets, um, those uh, that produce and, um, and, and import um, various plastic items, and all of us have a role to play. So we want to ensure with the marine litter Action, uh, management action plan that we have that coherence, we have that coordination, we know the entities and everyone knows what their roles and responsibilities are. The meeting also sought to identify the sources of pollution to develop an inventory. So we want to be able to look at this very closely and see where is our waste coming from, where are the pathways, are we managing our waste properly? Why is it ending up in the streams and the, and, and the ravines and the gutters and the drains that end up being a problem when we have heavy rainfall, so we have clogging of the drains? The Sustainable Development Ministry expects the Marine Litter Management Action Plan to be approved and endorsed by the end of 2022. Gina Filippi, HDS News Force.